Republican House Speaker Mike Johnson's job is on the line. He's already proven that he has broken the conference's trust. He passed the Biden administration's agenda. His most vocal critic, Georgia's Marjorie Taylor Greene, could call a promotion to oust him at any moment. To Green, strike one was passing a funding bill with help from Democrats that didn't cut spending but kept the government open. Now he's supporting the reauthorization of FISA, a controversial surveillance program, and more funding for Ukraine. Some people back home don't realize we have the smallest majority in U.S. history. Many of Johnson's detractors are former President Donald Trump's strongest allies. They shot down a procedural vote for FISA on the House floor Wednesday following strong condemnation from Donald Trump. Hopefully Speaker Johnson's talking to Donald Trump a lot, trying to get some advice and some guidance. Yeah. Because he's the only one that can save America right now. Trump. Johnson will meet with Trump tomorrow in Florida, where the two will hold a press conference on election integrity. We have a, a lot of things to discuss, talk to him frequently. FISA and the threats to Johnson's speakership from Green are sure to come up as well. One phone call might be able to straighten that out because there's a certain former president who has enormous sway over her. I'm not sure if he wants that mess in his election year. After another GOP lawmaker, Congressman Mike Gallagher resigns next week, Republicans will only be able to lose one vote on any party line bill. In Washington, Rebecca Castor, Fox News.